one and all. My name is John McCarthy, and I couldn't be happier that you chose to join us for this event here on the TGC Network. We are ready, folks. This is our final round coverage of this first event of the season. Exciting times ahead. I am interested to see how this uh, story concludes. And he can't be too happy with that shot. I think he'll be happy with that. And this is to save par. And a decent putt. And starting the round off at even par. And now let's see what this second hole has in store. like a seven iron. Ah, poor luck on that approach shot. Too much club on that, I think. And about eight feet to the cup. Ooh, and that was very, very close. And this putt is for bogey. And finishing the hole with a solid putt. And it looks like he moved down on the leaderboard after that one. Now let's see what this third hole has in store. Nothing wrong with that. From 250 yards out. Five feet to go here. And that one will drop for par. And one over for the day after that hole. All right, here's the fourth hole.
And this for the birdie. Oh my, this is looking very, very promising. And that putt will drop for birdie. And that one's gonna bring him down to even par. And he's currently tied for second place on the leaderboard. Well, so far so good for this one. From about 120 yards. And I think this is looking a bit long. Well, turns out that one is safely on the green. Ooh, that, that would have been good. And for the par. And a nice putt there. And after that one, he will share the top spot on the leaderboard. And moving on to the sixth here. I don't think we'll find some fairway here. And this next shot setting up significantly below the hole. And uh, not the greatest of swings on that approach shot. I think the wind got the best of that. And this putt is essential to save par. Oh my goodness, close, very close, but no cigar. And about six feet to go here. Oh. And this putt for double bogey. Now let's see how things are shaping up on the leaderboard. And he will fall out of first place after that one. And teeing off on this par four. And he's got to be happy with that.
and about four feet from the cup. And that putt will drop for par. And after that one, plus two for the day. And the wind definitely could be a factor on this one. Let's see how this tee shot goes. Looking good. From 18 feet. I thought that was going to go. And it's about a few feet from the cup. And the par putt will drop. And nothing changes for them after that hole. Still in ninth place. And next up we have a par five hole. It appears to be heading for the fairway here. And this putt is for birdie. And a good putt. And he is moving up on the leaderboard after that hole. Okay, and the 10th hole. It's looking like it's heading into the fairway. From 130 yards. Taking a shot with the pitching wedge. And ladies and gentlemen, that was a that was a poor approach. Too much club. And this putt to save par. And after that hole, one over the day. And he's tied for second place on the leaderboard. Going with the eight iron.
And uh, I think he's going to like that. 14 feet away. Ooh, and that was very close, but it just didn't, didn't drop. And now let's uh, take a look and see what's happening up on that leaderboard. And no change uh, ranking-wise after that hole. Well, this one's looking like it's in the fairway. And about 210 to the pin from here. Going with the hybrid here. This could be good. It's heading for the green here. And not the best approach shot. Too much club. This putt's about five feet from the cup. Oh, and I thought that was going to go. And this putt is for bogey. And currently sitting at two over for the day. And he's tied for third place. Pretty sure he's gonna like that one. And this one's for Birdie. Oh my gracious, that was close. And now let's take a look at the leaderboard. And he's moving in the right direction, moving up on the leaderboard after that hole. And setting up now on the 14th tee. This putt's right around a nine-footer. Okay, and now let's uh, take a peek and see what's happening on the leaderboard. And they will stay in second place after that hole. And setting up for the par five hole. And he's probably going to like that. Ooh. 
Looks like this is bound for some rough. And it looks like he's going through the branches here on this one. And about four feet from the cup. And that one will drop for bogey. And currently sitting at plus three for the day after that hole. And next up is a par four, folks. And this is about a 105 yard shot to the pin. Sixteen feet. For the bird. And after that one, he's going to share the lead for this event. And here's the six iron. Well, I don't think they meant to do that on the approach. And this to save par. Ooh, that one's, uh, that's too bad. And this one's for the bogey. And after that one, let's uh, take a look at the leaderboard. And unfortunately, he falls out of first after that one. And as he tees off on the 18th, he is just one stroke off the lead. And he's tied for third place on the leaderboard. And a promising looking shot here. And about 185 yards to the pin. Going with the four iron here.
Nice shot. I think you'll like that. This next putt for a final round score of 71. And tapping in to end the round with a par. And as this event comes to an end, he will end up tied for second place. And that's going to do it for our broadcast here today. Thank you very much for me and uh, the team here at the TGC Network. See you next time.